English Around the Clock, Dinner Time Vocabulary. Hello learners! Welcome to another video in our series, English Around the Clock. Today, we're going to focus on one of the most important times of the day, the evening. Specifically, we will be exploring the vocabulary related to meals and mealtimes during the evening. First, let's clarify what we mean by evening. In English, evening generally refers to the period of time at the end of the day, starting from around 5 p.m. and lasting until around 9 p.m. This can vary based on culture and personal habits. In the context of meals and mealtimes, evening is usually associated with dinner. Dinner is the main meal of the day, eaten in the evening or at midday in some cultures. For now, we'll focus on dinner as an evening meal. Now, let's dive into the specific vocabulary that you might use during evening meals. Dinner. As we've mentioned, dinner is the main meal that people eat in the evening. Supper. Supper is another word for a light evening meal, and it is less commonly used than dinner. Dessert. This is a sweet course that concludes a meal. Desserts can be cakes, cookies, ice cream, fruit, and so on. Appetizer. This is a small dish served before the main course to stimulate the appetite. Main course. The most substantial course of a meal. Let's put these words into some sentences. What's for dinner tonight? Shall we have some dessert after dinner? The appetizer was delicious. I can't wait for the main course. Next, we'll learn some common phrases used during evening meals. Could you set the table for dinner? Would you like some more gravy on your meat? This dish is mouth-watering. I'm stuffed. I couldn't eat another bite. Remember, practice makes perfect. The more you use these words and phrases, the more natural they will become in your speech. And that wraps up our discussion on the vocabulary and phrases related to evening meals. Remember, the evening meal is an important time of day when families and friends often come together to share food and conversation. Keep practicing these words and phrases at your own dinner table, and you'll soon find yourself sounding more and more like a native speaker. Until next time, happy learning and enjoy your meals.